What's going on everybody? This your boy Be Easy and welcome back to Be Easy Shooting Fast Reviews. Now today I'm doing an unboxing of the side collection D1 Wise Super Villains aka the MF Dooms. Rest in peace MF Doom. Now if this is your first time here, here you see me reviewing some of your most notable shoes in fashion as well as the hottest style for the majority of the pieces that I see. But the most important part of this channel is I shine a spotlight some of your new and up and coming fashion brands and designers. So hit that like button, hit the subscribe button and plug the notification bell. You never know, you might see a designer that you never heard of to fit your style. But all that being said, let's get to the heat. Here we go. These are the D1 Wise, D1 Yourself, Super Villains, AKA MF Doom. A great looking shoe. This color is silver, black, and white. There's not too much I can say bad about this shoe. Only thing that's bad about the shoe is they're not mine. I don't own them. This is a great looking shoe. The quality is like no other. Definitely got to support independent shoe companies and brands like this for giving out this good of a quality shoe here. It's definitely an eye turner, eye catcher. This silver hits off this black patent leather. To me, they're not like your silver toes. They remind me more of your um, Kawhi Leonard's that came out a couple years back. I'm gonna get into detail, not getting too much detail, but. Right in the front, you got your silver. Around all the silver, you have white stitching going across. And the toe, you got black. On the side, you have your vulture, the dead vulture, with a silver stitching on its eye. Your midsole was white. Your sole is that icy blue. And it's not your typical so that you'll see on this type of shoe right here. Here you have his logo Sire with stars going around. And in the middle you have Sire Collective with the Vulture. You have your buckle on this side right here. Side on this shoe, you have Sire going across here. Going up to the shoestrings, you have a like semi waxy shoestring, not your average shoestring you would get on a Jordan 1. Going up, you have a double tongue. Let me switch the shoe better. You have a double tongue here. You have diamond stitching going up the tongue. And on the top of it reads Side Collective somewhere in America. And you have a silver vulture with collective right under it. The details is up. Uh, it's great. Now on this side of the shoe, you have the Sire on this one with the buckle and the Vulture on the media side. This one, you have the Sire on the inside and the Vulture on the outside. The details on this is great. My favorite part of the whole shoe is the diamond stitching you get around the anklet and the padding is great. But the number one that I applaud him is the MF Doom face mask back there. The stitching in here is great. Now you do get two pairs of shoestrings. You get the black and the white. This is not just for aesthetics. This is actually a full shoestring here. Um, there's do ones yourself. I mean, you can change some things up. Like for instance, here you have a broken anklet on this one. You can change your suit strings from white to black and vice versa. Everything about the shoe was great. Here, you don't want to wear the broken anklet. The two loops go right here if you did want to wear them. Me, I personally wouldn't wear them. It's just my preference. On the inside, you have your Sire logo. And man, this is a great shoe, man. Definitely me being a sneakerhead, uh, and I grew up with people wearing custom shoes. This right here kind of brings back nostalgia. And if you know anything about Side Collective, that's where uh, Mr. Devin actually started customizing sneakers. So to me, this kind of pays homage. 
understand a lot of people going on with this. Oh, it looks like a Jordan one, but a lot of customizers used that Jordan. So to see him do it in his own shoe, put his own taste to it, uh, it's too much I can't say. I like the shoe, um, which they were mine again, I said it before. I like the details of everything. Um, as you see, this is a little higher than your average joy. Definitely. Can't complain about the quality. Can't complain about the look. Now, if y'all seen, I do have the Vultures, Lakers, AKA Mamba Outs. I wish I had these. Definitely check the man out. These was a member exclusive. I mean, is that too much I can say? But this is a nice shoe. You'll have some people who don't like type of shoe. Some people will. Me being a true sneakerhead, I like all fashion and shoes. I'm always going to support um, small companies. And uh, I'm going to continue to support this brother here. Let me know if you like them in the comments. Let me know how you feel about the shoe, how you feel about the company. Uh, if he come out with these again, would you buy them? I definitely will. And before we leave here, I gotta give you that good B-roll of the shoe here. right I hope you like that b-roll if you liked everything you've seen hit the like button hit the subscribe button plus the notification bell <laughs> and like always never look down at anybody unless you're checking out their sneakers i'm out